Hello everyone, my name is Craig Glover. I'm the market development manager for Chasing, and today we're gonna see what's inside the Gladius Mini box. So let's get to it. First, here's the box. Very well constructed, looks very durable. It's got a nice handle on it. So let's go ahead and open it up and let's see what's inside. All right, let's turn this around so everyone can see. Got some nice, really good foam inserting here to make sure everything is safe during transport. Looks like there's two levels to the box. Um, so let's just start pulling everything out. First, we have the Gladius Mini user manual, which has all kinds of different spare parts in it from screws to O-rings to uh, caps. It also looks like some attachments for the bracket on the remote control. Very cool. Lots of good information there. We'll put that there. Next, we have some uh, storage bags. So once you're done diving and the product's wet and you don't want to get your backpack or your Pelican case or anything wet, go ahead and throw your uh, products in there, especially the, the ones that get wet, meaning the tether and also the drone because the base station and the remote are not waterproof. So do not get those wet. We'll just put those here since it's a little windy today and I want them blowing all over the place. Next, we will go ahead and pull out what seems looks to be this is the charging unit for the drone and the base station. So you got that. It's got the uh, tether on one on the other end, the female side, which is going to plug into the back side of the drone and or the base station here. This is the power cord for the uh, charging system. So we'll put that there. That goes into a, a wall outlet. And then on the other side, we have a USB uh, plug that will actually uh, charge the remote. So we'll go ahead and put that there as well. So that's the whole charging unit. Next, we have the base station. This is your Wi-Fi connection from the drone to your mobile device. We have the uh, saltwater buoyancy weight that will go on the bottom of the drone. Obviously, uh, the default one is the fresh water. So if you're ever gonna swim in the salt water, you're gonna wanna use this. Next, we have the remote control with all the accessories and we'll get into more videos about this. It's a very basic remote control, feels really good on your hands. Next, we have the bracketing system for the remote. This is what's gonna hold your device, either your tablet or your iPhone or your Android phone. We'll take off the top, really cool. This packaging is really nice to make sure that everything stays nice and stable inside there and doesn't get damaged. We have a towel. This is a really great uh, feature here to have. So you can go ahead and wipe your drone down when you're done swimming. Make sure that you wash that drone out after every dive, whether it be fresh water, salt water, chlorine water, swamp water, whatever. All right, here we have the Gladius Mini. Looking really good. Go ahead and set that down here. And last but not least, we have the tethering system. So this is basically what's in the box. Um, this has the great user manual with all the information you're gonna need to get started and going. And then, like I said, a lot of extra tools, screws for the drone, O-rings for the tether, and then also the uh, replacement caps for the top of the drone and the front of the base station. And then also a couple of extra screws for the mounting bracket. So in case you lose any of that stuff, we have it right there for you so that you can replace it really quickly. So this has been the unboxing. My name is Craig. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, please like, and please comment below if you have any questions. We'll be getting to a lot more videos, breaking down each accessory. Until then, we'll see you next time.